Do y'all want this figure? Then go on over to Chosen Prime where they can take good care of you, man. They got everything from Transformers, Power Rangers, Turtles, Marvel, DC, statues, whatever your heart desires. Follow that link down in the description and you can buy this Transformer as well. So just tell them that Deluxe sends you and you might actually get a virtual hug. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Thank you for coming back as always. I appreciate it. Really hope you're having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm the Lux. All right, let's do another transfer review. Yeah, and woo, doggy, got a good one today. So take a look at Generation Select's Artfire and Nightstick. So Artfire is a redeco of the Inferno, and Nightstick is a redeco of Singe. I think the Battlemaster Singe. I think so, but uh, the box, same old, same old Generation Select. You see the Autobot, very nice, like the wraparound. And then you got the... Art, you know, art fire, not stick, and that's about it. Nothing, you know, nothing too special. Transformer, Warrior, Cybertron, all that wonderful stuff. So let's just get right to the review. That's what you came for. Yeah. And as always, let's take a quick look what he comes with. He comes with two hoes in this house. He got hoes in this house. If you see them, point them out. Yeah, so he gets two of these. No paint, just a little sculpt work in there. A little line work right there. Then he gets two nozzles. One is just a uh, gray plastic. Looks pretty good. And then you get one, you can switch out his hand or, you know, and replace his hand. And that's painted silver, so that's really good. You get blast effects. Yay! I get to add some to my little uh, stash. So you get these. They're nicely translucent blue, so, you know, for water because he is a uh, fire truck. And you get these two as well. Awesome. I love blast effects. You get his rifle. Very nice. No paint. But nice sculpt work in there. Very cool. And they will hold the uh, blast effects too. Awesome, awesome. And here is Nightstick real quick. I'm going to go over him. He's not, not much to him. No paint or anything like that. Got the nice little rocket little launcher things. But there he is. He is a target master. So you just untab those, those arms, flip out the legs, move that right there, and there you go. Bam. Nice red paint for the face. No articulation there, but he does go up to there, all the way around. No waist swivel or anything like that. You can Van Dam all day, every day. Kick up, move this back a little bit and kick back. And a little thigh swivel, not much. And that is about it. So yeah, there you go. That is his Target Master Nightstick, and that is what he comes with. Yay. And real quick, want to show you that you can store everything on him. So you got the hose right here. They're on one on the one side and on the other side. Place his gun right there. Looks nice. The target master can go right here. You can go on either side if you want. There's one of the nozzles. And there's the other nozzle. And then you got the blast effects. So he's going to save some kittens. So pretty cool. So yeah, very nice. You can store everything on him. Awesome. Awesome. And let's take a quick look at Artfire in his alt mode, and I love it. I love the Inferno mode, the grapple mode. Uh, the grapple mode was pretty good. I'm glad they fixed the uh, little tab. A lot of people, when they got theirs, it was it would get stuck in, but now it don't go all the way in. So the Inferno uh, mode fixed that, and that was really cool. So the grapple mode, a lot of people were breaking that off. But there you go. Very nice silver paint. You got the nice red um, Autobot symbol. Mine's kind of crooked a little bit. Uh, white paint for the little square for the background. Nice translucent blue right here and for the um, siren lights. And then, then you got the nice uh, translucent blue also for the headlights. Nice silver paint, like I said. Black paint for the um, windshield wipers. Uh, red paint right there. Looks good. And like I said, once again, the nice translucent blue. Then you got the nice little fog, little horns up here. Uh, the, the rims right here are not painted, but these are painted back here. So that is good. You got a little red paint right here. This whole section right here that the hose and the, I forgot what that's called. It goes down to maybe, you know, uh, give it stability. I forgot what they're called. Stabilizers, maybe? <laughs> that's it. I think they're stabilizers. But yeah, the, uh, they don't go down. Uh, I don't think, no, they don't go down. Uh, but this is painted. I think that's painted silver and that's painted red. That's painted red. So very nice. And then you got the little wings right here. Paint white, white paint right here. White paint right here. Very nice. There you go. Now you got the ladder. It will go up quite a bit all the way back and it will swivel 360. So that is good. And this will retract as well. It's a tight fit, but it will go in there. So you can retract it like that if you want to. 
or extend it. So very nice. You got the top. Uh, that's black plastic right there. So very nice. But yeah, nicely painted. Nice sculpt. There you go. That is Artfire. All right, good stuff. And there's Scoop and Red Alert, so they go together real well. Uh, he is a Voyager scale, so then we're two deluxes. And that's scale for you right there, buddy. And Crapper Garnish, crappy tool paper, some Lysol and Care Bears for more scale. All right, let's see if I can remember how to transform this fella. I took everything off except for the hose, because you don't have to take those off. All right, so you want to collapse the ladder in and do that. Then you want to come and untab. Like I said, they fixed that area right there, so you be kind of hard to break that all right then you want to untab this one's already untabbed i'll show you this one so you untab right there so there's a tab and goes into that slot right there and you want to bring down the legs or the waist the whole legs and the waist like that then you want to come and move the leg feet sorry the feet like that you just collapse them it's on a hinge right there then you want to take untab the arms right there then tab right here into there like that and then you can bring out the hand if you want to or there's a nozzle you can replace the hand with and tab that in right there and move that over here all right then you want to come around flip this right here to reveal the head then you want to come and fold this up like that, fold that down like that, then another fold, and then tab the top part up to here, like that, bring this down, like that, and there you go. You wanna flip out his little wings, and they are tabbed into right there, and there you go. That is how you transform Art Fire. Let me clean them up and I'll be right back. All right, real quick, I'm gonna show you with the weapons like I did. I just flipped the hand around and you put that little nozzle on there and then you can hold his target master right there. You can place his gun, you can hold his gun or you can take you know both hands. You got a couple options for the weapons. That's pretty cool. You still store this nozzle right here and the hose right there. Pretty cool. And then you can put a little blast effect right here on the nozzle and there you go. He's ready to fight some fires. So that's what you can do with his weapons. All right, let's take a quick look at Art Fire and his articulation and sculpt work. There's the head sculpt, very nice. Looks like Inferno. The nice silver paint, beautiful blue eyes. And you got some blue paint right here for the ears and you got some silver paint for the head crest. So very nice. I like the translucent blue right here for the lights, his chest, the lights right here. You've seen all the paint, all that stuff. Silver paint right here. And you got the uh, little wings. And you got the front of the chest for the um, for his chest or the front of the uh, car for that. And you got this nicely painted red. That's all painted red, and this is painted red too as well. And you got paint, white paint right there. And in the back, you know, it's got the ladder. I think cleans up pretty good. I think. All right. So as far as articulation, swivel, and that is about it. Really can't do much with his head because he's got this little protective case or whatever box that he really can't do a lot so just a swivel all right up to there 90 degrees now the tolerances there is a little, not as tight you know it will, this will come untabbed quite a bit you know if you do anything that does give you a backwards uh, butterfly if you want to have that that's awesome uh, these move back and forth and that is it so you can move that out of the way go all the way around you got a nice about 90 a little uh, about 90 degrees a little bit a bit, uh, little more than 90 degrees for the elbow bend bosses swivel tons of um of, <laughs> of waffles and everything my boy lockers lair he's already made a kit for this and he's got to fill those gaps in these gaps and these gaps and all that stuff so very good and for the hand no swivel but in and out just because of transformation so that's cool all right waist swivel very nice move these out of the way these don't stay in tab they will move on you quite a bit too as well van dam all day every day i like how the the uh, hips they go with it so there you go kick up kick down nice thigh swivel 90 degrees for the knee bend Whoa, kicking ass kicking ass all right toe tilt down toe tilt up 
and a nice rocker. So very nice. So you can use this little hinge right here to do some ass kicking right there, buddy. How about that? So very nice. And like I said, here is the back. You don't have to have that on there, but you can leave it on there. You can move it out of the way if you don't want it hanging. So, you know, very nice. Once again, some waffles in the house. Love some waffles. You do got some five millimeter ports right here and here, so you can add on some stuff if you want to. It's, it's your transformer. You do whatever you want to. Have fun with it. That's what I like doing. So there you go. That is Art Fire and his articulation and sculpt work. All right. Looks good. And there he is next to uh, Studio Series Redgar. You got Optimus Prime, Ironhide, and you got Red Alert right there for him. Let's go. There's some scale for you right there. And Crapper Garnish, Crappy Tool Paper, some Lysol, Care Bears, and Squeaks for more scale. All right, folks, let's talk about some Generation Selects, Art Fire, and his uh, Target Master Nightstick. I love this mold. I like the Inferno. I like the Grapple one, too. Mine didn't break, thank you, you know, thankfully. Um, but the Inferno mode, when they fixed that little part right back here, that you know, to not let it break or anything with the uh, tabs, that was awesome. That was genius. And they did it with the Art Fire, too. I like this mold really good. I mean, you get the you know Target Master, you get Blast Effects, you get the Weapons. Freaking awesome. I love it. I really like this mold. It's a good mold. Yeah, I like the alt mode. Looks really good. I like that it matches with red alert. They go together really well. Uh, transformation's real easy. Shouldn't take you very long to figure that out. The bot mode looks really good. The paint on here is really, really nice. A lot of paint that I like. A lot of red. You got the white paint down here. Silver. I love the chest. I love that translucent blue. The head scope looks good. It looks very nice. I like I said, it's awesome. Articulation's really good, too. Only thing it needs is really is a, a app crunch. But other than that, you got tons of articulation. You get some good poses. Like I said, the blast effects really add to the, you know, playability. You know, taking pictures like that. Very nice. Uh, only issues I really would say anything would be the tolerances right here. Like when you're trying to move or something like that, they will pop out a little bit. But other than that, I really don't find anything wrong. But just the waffles, you know, like I said, that can be fixed, too. Like I said, my boy uh, Larkin, he's going to... Uh, uh, get that fixed and everything so yeah very nice i highly recommend this guy he's awesome so that was my review over uh generation selects art fire hope you liked it hit me up some likes shares prayers and care bears go there and hit that sub button for me if you don't mind it really helps out the channel and uh hit me up some comments tell me you thought of the review has anybody got this guy already has anybody got him on pre-order uh, i got mine at chosen prime and uh, i think he's been found in stores too uh, at gamestop so you know look around for your gamestop and i guess i'll see you in the next transform review and as always be good to yourself. Hail Hasbro and good night, folks. What's up, everybody? Alpha Bravo. How you doing? I'm good. All right. All right. Good night, folks. This is awesome. I love it.